I'm Perry Matter on Redskins.com, one-on-one with running back Capri Bibbs. And Capri certainly uh, first first game with the Redskins, first touchdown with the Redskins. You know, how much feedback have you gotten from friends and family uh, throughout that day and the week? You know, uh, I think for the most part, my family is really happy, you know what I mean, that I'm getting the opportunity in the first place. Um, I was out in Orlando training at Tom Shaw for about 10 weeks, and so I finally got, you know, the right call for me. I had a probably a couple workouts, but... You know, ultimately, this ended up being a team that I signed with, and I was I was more uh, more happy about that than anything. So how do you how do you feel like you fit in? It seems like I mean, Chris Thompson kind of had the role that you're now filling in. How do you feel like you fit in as a guy that can both catch the ball out of the backfield and take it on the ground? Yeah, uh, you know, I like to always view myself as a jack of all trades kind of guy. You know, being able to run routes and out of college, I had 1,700 rushing yards in eight games with no catches, you know what I mean? And I think the evaluation on me is that I couldn't catch the ball, and I just, I laughed at that because I think that was absolutely false, you know, but that was only for me to, only something for me to show in the league. So now that the Redskins are giving me the opportunity to show that I'm a third down back is, is amazing, you know, because this is, if this is how I have to contribute to this team and show them and prove them my worth and show them that I'm really down for them, then I'll do it, I'll do anything, you know. This is, this is something that I've been dreaming of, so. Well, you get to see a team that you actually know quite a bit about this week. Um, you know, I just want to ask you about the defense. I mean, you see them every day in practice. You saw them on the sidelines a bit. You know, what makes them so special? You know, um, it, you know, it's crazy that you asked me that question because this is something that I, I tend to utter. You know what I mean? Even to some of the guys around here. You know, I'm 24 years old. This is my fourth year in the league, and. You know, a lot of people see me. They're like, "Okay, he's young," but I got I got a chance to learn from a lot of a lot of vets. You know what I mean? And, and a lot of guys that knew how to do everything the right way. And I think that's one of the biggest things I, I I learned in Denver was those guys. They had a lot of chemistry. You know what I mean? They hung around each other a lot. They did a lot of things together, and they held each other accountable. And that was one of the biggest things. They always held each other accountable. Meeting rooms, off the field. You know what I mean? Whatever it was, and I think that's what made their team gel is because they didn't ask for coaches to, you know what I mean, to do certain things. You know, they did them and took it amongst themselves, and that's why um, I I try to implement that a, a lot along here. It's something that I learned, you know what I mean, and bringing that into this building because I think that that is what makes a great team is when the players, you know what I mean, hold each other accountable and and have that chemistry and that bond like a brotherhood. You know what I mean? This is very well a, a business and a job. But at the same time, you know, if, if it becomes like a brotherhood and a family, you got to, your chances of winning go through the roof.